children in this lesson we will learn the use of factors by multiplication you all know bablu is very naughty one day while roaming around he went far into the forest and reached the other village there he saw a big house bablu thought that he will rest there for a while and went inside the house as he walked in he saw three boxes on the table and in each box there were 10 apples can you tell how many apples were there in total how will we write this by using multiplication 3 multiplied by 10 now using the multiplication of 3 how many are these 30 bablu was very hungry of the three boxes one of the box had delicious red apples bablu ate a few apples from that box now bablu went to a room it was a huge room with two cupboards each cupboard had five shelves can you find out How many shelves were there in total? How will we write this by using multiplication? Two multiplied with five. How much is it? Ten. Bablu took a few toys from one of those cupboards and started playing with them. Now Bablu again started to feel hungry. In the room, he saw a box of sweets that looked like this. The box contained a total of 35 laddus. There were 7 vertical slots in the box. Can you tell how many laddus were there in each vertical slot? This question can be written in multiplication form like this. Now, can you make use of the method of finding factors learned in the last lesson? and find the answer to this puzzle you just have to find out when does 35 appear in the table of 7 so what multiplied with 7 is 35 5 multiplied with 7 each slot of the box had 5 laddus bablu ate a lot of laddus and started feeling sleepy Bablu slept on the bed. Suddenly, Bablu heard some voices. When Bablu tried to see in his half-asleep state, everything looked hazy to him, and he could only see eighteen buttons. If every person present there had six buttons each. on their shirt then can you tell how many people were standing there yes you have solved it correctly three people were standing in front of bablu actually bablu had reached bubu bear's house bubu and his family were surprised to see him there The moment Bablu saw Bubu, he ran away and did not return back again. Children, in this chapter, we learn some interesting uses of factors.